Welcome to Basic Info Tales. Today we explore the farthest reaches of our planet where nature's power manifests in scorching heat and bone-chilling cold. From the sun-baked deserts of the Arabian Peninsula to the icy plains of Siberia, we'll uncover the stories behind Earth's hottest and coldest countries. Our journey begins in Kuwait, a small nation on the Arabian Gulf known for its relentless summer heat. In the summer of 2016, Kuwait City recorded a staggering 54 degrees Celsius, one of the highest temperatures ever recorded on Earth. Life in Kuwait is dictated by the sun. During the hottest hours, the streets fall silent as people seek refuge indoors. But as the sun sets, life returns to the streets. Markets bustle, families emerge for evening strolls, and the air fills with laughter and conversation. It's a testament to the enduring spirit of the Kuwaiti people, who have adapted to thrive in one of the hottest places on Earth. Our next stop takes us to the United Arab Emirates, a nation synonymous with towering skyscrapers, luxurious living, and intense desert heat. Imagine standing at the base of the Burj Khalifa, the world's tallest building, feeling the heat radiating from the sun and the concrete jungle around you. Yet, life in the UAE thrives. Air conditioning offers a welcome respite, transforming indoor spaces into cool oases. And when the sun dips below the horizon, the desert cools, offering a chance to experience the unique beauty of this environment. From sunset camel rides across the dunes to evenings under the starlit sky, the UAE offers a glimpse into a way of life perfectly adapted to its desert climate. Our exploration of extreme heat takes us now to Saudi Arabia, a country where the desert reigns supreme. The Arabian Desert, a vast expanse of sand and rock, dominates much of the landscape, creating an environment of intense heat and aridity. Temperatures here can soar, regularly exceeding 50 degrees Celsius in the summer months. Despite these harsh conditions, life persists. Bedouin tribes have traversed these unforgiving landscapes for centuries, They've developed remarkable ways to survive, finding water in hidden oases and seeking shade in the shadows of towering rock formations. The resilience of the Bedouin people showcases our ability to thrive, even in the most challenging environments. From the scorching deserts of the Middle East, we journey now to the frigid plains of Siberia, Russia. Deep in the heart of Siberia lies the village of Oymyakon, often dubbed the Pole of Cold. This remote village holds the record for the lowest temperature ever recorded outside of Antarctica, a bone-chilling 67.7 degrees Celsius. Life in Oymyakon is a testament to human resilience. The air itself seems to crackle with cold, and even breathing can be a challenge. The people of Oymyakon have adapted to survive, wearing layers of furs and relying on traditional methods to stay warm. Despite the harsh conditions, life finds a way with children playing on frozen lakes and families gathering around crackling fires for warmth and companionship. Our journey through Earth's coldest countries takes us next to Canada, a nation known for its stunning natural beauty and long, harsh winters. While Southern Canada enjoys relatively mild temperatures, the Northern Territories experience a different kind of winter. Imagine a world blanketed in white where the sun barely peaks above the horizon for months on end. But despite the challenges of living in a land of perpetual winter, Canadians have embraced the cold. From ice hockey on frozen ponds to dog sledding expeditions across vast snow-covered expanses, Canadians have turned winter into a season of joy and adventure. They've proven that even in the face of extreme cold, life finds a way to not just survive, but to thrive. Our final destination takes us to Greenland, the world's largest island and a land dominated by ice. Over 80% of Greenland is covered in a permanent ice sheet, a vast expanse of white that reflects the sun's rays and contributes to the island's frigid temperatures. Winters here are long and dark, with temperatures rarely rising above freezing. Yet, life finds a way. Indigenous Inuit communities have thrived in Greenland for centuries, their culture and traditions deeply intertwined with the icy landscape. They've learned to navigate the frozen terrain, hunt for seals and whales, and build shelters that withstand the extreme cold. 
Their knowledge and resilience offer a powerful lesson in adaptation and respect for the natural world. From the scorching deserts of the Middle East to the frozen wastelands of the Arctic, our journey has revealed the incredible diversity of Earth's climates and the resilience of life that inhabits these extreme environments. These stories serve as a powerful reminder of the adaptability of life and the importance of respecting the delicate balance of our planet.